A church burned to the ground overnight in Falmouth, Kentucky. Local 12's Adam Clements joins us live with what he's been able to learn. Adam. Well, Paula, I want you to show I want to show you behind me here the building that you see, the tall white portion of the building. This is where uh, the folks gather, the assembly hall here uh, at the Chapel of Praise Assembly of God Church here in Falmouth. Just a few feet over, the actual sanctuary. Take a look inside. A complete loss, just a pile of rubble and ash as a result of that fire. Now, neighbors across the street tell me that right around 3 o'clock this morning, they heard a loud popping sound. They rushed to their front window, looked out, and saw the church up in flames, smoke uh, pouring out of the windows. They say the heaviest of the flames were coming from the front of the building. Now, right around that same time, fire crews arrived on the scene to find much of the same. At one point, there were more than a dozen firefighters here, at least 15 to 20. They were working to contain the fire. They were running five tankers in to help. Now, fortunately, there were no injuries. No one was inside at the time of the fire. I did have a chance to speak with a pastor of the church. He didn't want to go on camera, but he did tell me that he was the last person to leave the church, and that was right around 8 o'clock last night. He says he turned off the furnace. There was no electricity running, but he did say that there was a large neon cross hanging on the outside of the front of the building, and while he couldn't say with any degree of certainty that that is what triggered the blaze, he suspects it may have played a part. But again, the sanctuary, the place where folks come and gather each and every Sunday, a complete loss burned to the ground. Right now, the fire is under investigation, and at this time, it is in the hands of the state fire marshal here in Kentucky. Reporting live in Falmouth, Adam Clements, Local 12 News. Paula, back to you. And Adam, you say it's where people gather every Sunday. Have they made any plans for next Sunday? Is it just too early to be speculating about that kind of change yet? Right now, the pastor told me his first priority is getting with the insurance company and trying to figure out how they can move forward and getting this cleaned up uh, and getting on with things here at the church. He didn't mention anything about Sunday. I would imagine that that will be uh, next on his agenda. Yeah, I'm sure someone will offer them a place. Thank you, Adam. We'll keep people informed.